Hi guys, VST here, we're at Freestech. Some updates on the OnePlus stock application. So there is a new update on the OnePlus weather, the OnePlus gallery and also the OnePlus launcher, guys. So before I continue with this video, and if you are for the first time here, you might consider as well subscribing to my channel. So I do a lot of OnePlus video, Samsung video, tech videos, reviews, Google camera, a lot of nice stuff here. You might want to check my playlist, but to continue here on the topic, guys, if you go to Play Store, and if you go to my apps, and if I go to beta, because I am apparently a beta tester for everything that I can get my hands on, there is apparently a new version on the OnePlus Weather that has been just released several days ago. So last updated, you see here, 15 of October. So the news here is you can see new and improved visual experience also adapted for Android R for increased efficiency. Android R is Android 11. Note in this update, widgets have been disabled in the weather app. To use the widgets, you need to long press the launcher, select widget, find the OP OnePlus widget and select widget with the weather information. In the future, this shelf will be improved to provide more weather information. Stay tuned, okay? So that's one thing I will show you. Then very important, guys, also the OnePlus Gallery. You can see the OnePlus Gallery has been updated on the 19th of October, so it's very, very recent and fresh. This upgrade version includes fixing the issue of the map missing in the Explore page, and that's something we can test, and also fixing errors of playing video with multiple accounts and optimize the experience after taking pictures. Now, honestly, I didn't really had the chance to see any bugs every time I was taking pictures, it was all nice. And last but not least, guys, there is also an update from the OnePlus launcher from the 16th of October. I saw again several days ago. Now again, the update is available on device with Android R, which is why they put Android R. I mean, it's so easy to just put Android 11 there. Refresh design of the shelf, providing a more intuitive view of the weather updates. And without any further ado, I'm going to demonstrate you guys what I can. Now, when I do like this, I just have here the Google feed, so I don't really have the the shelf and actually I really prefer to have here the Google feed instead of uh, the shelf but if you're fed on the shelf of course you can do and get so um, guys let's now launch the weather application because they said they kind of like updated the animation now honestly when I look what we have here to me it pretty much looks exactly as the previous version so if they did change something probably those are really very very tiny things so let me just see if I do it like this so it's you know select like city settings you know it's just pretty much the same for me so i don't really see any kind of like mind-blowing changes or animation still the same application all right so the next thing i'm going to show you guys is the gallery so they say that if you go here in the explorer let's just click here places previously apparently the map was not working now you see there's the city i live in now you see that everything is up and running and all the photos that you have taken really are shown properly on the map so indeed this now has been fixed and maybe that's also the thing that we can really touch and feel with our hands so if you really have the latest oneplus oxygen os 11 no matter if it's like the stable one or the open better to just go there and make sure to check this it's apparently fixed and i'm just gonna also do like a test i'm just gonna do a picture okay like that and then open it here i never really had a bug so this is really what i wanted to show you guys so updated oneplus launcher updated oneplus gallery and last but not least updated oneplus weather application all right very short video hopefully you find something interesting for you i'm gonna be putting the links down below to the apk if you want to test them on your phone but again it's designed to run on android 11 so just bear this in mind and with that said guys we're gonna catch up in my next video i'll leave you up with this vst over and bye